Hey, it's your boy Bobby Beach. I want to talk about a subject that comes to mind, and that is Power Book 3 Raising Canaan, which is a series that I don't see many people really talking about, if I have to be honest. Some people know about it, people, you know what I'm saying, but people are not really talking about it. So when it comes down to it, um, I know people are going to watch it. Uh, and Raising Canaan, um, it, it's book three. Uh, but a lot of people are um, really uh, looking forward to a, a lot of people are pretty much talking about P Tommy series, which is Power Book 4 Force and uh, Power Book 2 Ghost Season 2. Those are the main things I hear people talking about. Those are the main series people want to see. Now, uh, Book 3, Raising Canaan, is one that is not really talked about. It's a prequel and uh, it's about Canaan's story about how he came up. But at the, at the end of the day. Uh, it, it doesn't really, a lot of people, are, they're talking about it, but not really talking about it. As a matter of fact, I want to say BMF is probably getting more talked about than Raising Canaan. But I do know when Raising Canaan does come out, a lot of people are going to want to watch it. A lot of people are going to check it out. Now, when it comes down to it, Raising Canaan is in like the 90s. So we're talking about like late 90s, early 2000s. We're talking about that time. And Canaan is a teenager. And I know a lot of people are saying Ghost and Tommy is going to be in the series. I'm not quite sure because I did hear that Courtney said that she was going to keep Ghost and Tommy out. And is, she even uh, talk, as a matter of fact she even talked about potentially doing a series about Ghost and Tommy when they were young so that means they're not there and, and, and for them not to be there it really doesn't make any sense because they raised up with Kanan Kanan is really like their older brother and no matter how many times they wanted to get rid of him they never could really bring themselves to kill him to kill him it was a situation where it was like pretty much brothers fighting brothers and they always looked up, looked up to Kanan like he was the, you know pretty much the big brother he was the leader and Ghost became the leader he took the mantle from Kanan um and uh when it comes down to that uh it, for them not to be in uh, bu uh book three it doesn't really make any sense but we'll see how things turn out with that Book three doesn't really have excitement because people knows how things are going to go. We know what happened with Kanan and Power. Book one, Kanan ends up dying. He influenced Tyreek. He it was one of the uh, influences that turned Tyreek against Ghost. And not only that, we're in a situation where Tyreek regrets doing it because now Tyreek thinks, hey, my dad is the only person I can relate to. So now we're here with Kanan. We're going to see how Kanan come up. I see he's being raised by his mom. They say his dad's a cop, a crooked cop. But we'll see how that plays out. I, I think like when it comes down to it with this series, we're going to get straight 90s. You're going to get the real 90s. So I'm talking about like we're talking about Biggie, Wu-Tang Clan, Tupac, Snoop Dogg. You know, we're talking about that era. We're talking about the, those guys. We're talking about like Nas, uh, early Jay-Z, because Jay-Z really didn't start blowing up till really like the late um, 90s, early 2000s. But this is the era we're getting with them. I think that um, this story is going to be mainly influenced by Juice. I, if, if you guys never seen Juice, go back, watch Juice. But I think that uh, Kanan, Raising Kanan is going to be influenced by the Juice movie and probably a couple of other 90s films from back in the day. If I had to pick some, I'd probably say like New Jersey Drive, Into Deep, um, you know, different things of that nature like that, those types of movies. So we're going to be getting that. So that's what I'm thinking is coming up when it comes down to it. So uh, basically, I'm going to say Raising Kanan is going to be a pretty good show. I don't think it's going to be bad whatsoever. This is a power prequel. And I think the reason why uh, people are not really on it is because it's a prequel and where um, book uh, book four is a sequel and book two is a sequel book three is a prequel so I don't think there's too much hype for that so we'll see how it plays out I do know that um basically when it comes down to it you guys are enjoying this power verse thing I know that we're all enjoying it, but the main shows people really want to watch or main shows people like is book two ghosts, which a lot of people didn't know if they were going to like or not. And book four force. And then there's book five. Yes, there is a book five. It's called book five influence. Originally, book five was book four, but book five is influence and it's a uh, Tate series and it's about him and politics and seeing, you know, the stuff that goes on there. So that's pretty much what.